These are the most creative people you have to see before TikTok gets banned. Like this person who decided to crochet their ramen? I thought that ramen was food, not something to make a sweater out of. Mm, I love cake pop. Wait, they're making a cake pop that looks like Stitch? No way. This could be perfect for a themed party. Lilo and Stitch, but everything is made out of cake. I don't understand. Oh, wait, that's paint? How is that even possible? That looks so real. They took body art to a whole nother level. POV, it's dinner time, but in Lego world. So they're literally making some type of food. Okay, that's definitely meat that's being cooked. How is this even possible? It looks like it's real food, but it's not. Like, how is it cooking? Are they just changing the color of the Legos as it cooks? Like, I'm confused. You can't actually cook Lego. Oh, they even got cucumber. Stop. It's a Lego burger. Wait, that's real. Oh wait, I thought it was real sauce, but no, it's just Legos. Lego hamburger, anyone? So this artist used string to create an optical illusion art piece. Like the string goes out and it makes it look, I don't even know how to explain this because my brain would not be able to make this. Like how? Pancake art? This always looks so fun, but the second I try to do this, it does not look good. Wait, they're making Homer. Look. Homer Simpson? As a pancake? I would definitely eat that, I'm not gonna lie. They're putting so much detail into this that I literally am scared. I'm like, I don't know if it's gonna come out good or it's gonna be like burnt. It must be on a low setting of heat. It's not cooking too quick. How do you not burn the pancake? Because me? It would've already been burnt. It would've been at the highest setting of heat. <laughs> wait, this is actually so cool. I can't wait for them to flip over this pancake and see how it actually came out. Oh, wow. That's one big pancake, not gonna lie. That's perfect. And it's not burnt. Don't tell me they're gonna make a flower using this bag. Wait, what? That's so satisfying. But where did the yellow go? See, there's yellow in the middle, and then boom, it disappears. What kind of mind tricks are y'all playing on me? Micro crocheting. Does that mean like tiny? They're doing a tiny crochet. What is the purpose of this? I can't even see what they're making. It's so small. It's an octopus. Wait, that's actually so adorable. Cake art level 3000. Wait, are they making capybara? What the heck? I was not expecting that. It's a statue. No, it's an optical illusion. Wait, is that paper? What is that even made out? Why is that freaking me out? I don't know how I feel about that. The way the face stretches just gives me the heebie-jeebies. I don't know, I don't like it, I, I don't like it. Now this is what I'm talking about. I love food, so let's get creative. Oh, I thought it was gonna be a cloud, now it just looks like an egg. Is that supposed to be bacon made out of frosting? Stop! Why do these cupcakes look so good? I'm like, um, yes, breakfast, but make it cupcake breakfast. When they say you can't have dessert for breakfast, I'ma say I'll have the eggs and bacon. Cupcakes. Brit, Brit. Rick and Morty. Every time I see somebody this talented that they're literally making a Rick and Morty mug, I just remind myself how untalented I am. Like, how is it possible that somebody could make a work of art on a mug and I can't even draw a heart? What are they making? Why does that look like a frog? Oh, what is, it's kind of like, it's a keychain. At first I thought they were just playing with Play-Doh, but no. This is like a coloring book, but you peel off certain sections and then you use glitter to color them in. Tell me this isn't satisfying. ASMR is sending me. Why is Pikachu so cute? Where did you buy this or do you have to make it yourself? It looks like a one piece, so I feel like they've made this and then also colored it in and made it satisfying. Don't tell me they made Marge Simpson into a cake pop. Wait. Y'all are getting too creative with your food. It's just gonna end up in someone's stomach. The detail. Wow. It does look good though. Like, I'm not gonna lie. If I saw that, I would definitely buy it and eat it. This makes me want to go to Disney World and eat all the fun themed foods. 
When I watch people draw, I always think, I could do this. But then I try and it never looks like this. Like how is this a work of art? And they make it look so simple. They're just like lines and then there's Zendaya. How come when I scribble on paper, it doesn't ever end up looking like this? I could eat a whole family pack of Oreos by myself. Wow, I, I'm going to Disney. Anyone wanna come? <laughs> Tell me you're an artist without telling me you're an artist. There's two colors on that paintbrush and somehow it's coming out perfectly. You know you're good at art when it's literally so satisfying to just watch you do the art. Like, I didn't know I was gonna be mesmerized by someone painting. And how are they recording this? Do they have like a GoPro on their forehead? Art only using pink markers. Well, that's not a marker actually, so yes. Only using pink markers. Are these like those chalk markers? So pink, I wanna see, oh. Wait, this is not what I was expecting. I thought it was just gonna be a bunch of hearts that look kinda like this and not like that. How to double your money. Just draw new money. <laughs> There's no way that this is gonna look realistic like the actual money on the paper, unless that money is a drawing too. Now I'm sus. I feel like that drawing or that money on the top is also- So a drawing, wait, I'm getting confused. Oh, that's definitely not money. Oh, okay. At first, I thought the top money was actually a drawing, but it wasn't. Drawing a balloon because real balloons actually deflate and don't last forever. Apparently this is gonna look very realistic by the end. I, wait, it actually is kind of looking. Wait, I thought those were balloons. Let's paint. Start by putting a bunch of dots everywhere. I don't know how you start a painting by just putting dots everywhere. And then scribbling. Yes, this is definitely gonna be something. I don't know. Now they're using a makeup brush? Blending. Even your paint needs to be blended. How do dots turn into that? I can barely use makeup brushes to make my face look good and they're using it on a painting? Art that will hypnotize you. I always get sucked in by these videos and end up watching it 300 times. Oh, there we go. Now they're gonna erase some pieces. I'm obsessed. It gives me goosebumps. Like, how does it look like that? Oh. Okay, now we're adding a little scribble. Flower looking thing. And then erasing it. <laughs> Every time my boyfriend catches me watching these, he's like, how many times did you watch this? And my answer is always, yes. I love a good cone. Ooh, they could put milk in there. Oh, just kidding, they put a hole. A cake pop that looks like an ice cream cone? That's genius. I wish I was this creative. Then I would make a lot of food and then I would end up eating all the food by myself because nobody else would want to eat it because my cooking is bad. Every insanely good painting starts off with three dots. Three dots and there you go. You have the best painting in the world. How is it so easy for them to make this stuff? Like they're just literally swiping away. Like how, how does your swipes turn into art? See and then they act like right away. It just looks beautiful. Why does it look like kind of a sunset? And water? Bro, they're barely adding anything and yet it looks magnificent. It's not only just art, it's also ASMR art. Hopefully TikTok doesn't get banned, but if it does, you can watch one of these videos.